Okay, in this video I'm going to show with Malwarebytes how to actually get it to select all of the pops and different issues that come up because by default it does not check every single thing. So you'll open it up, you'll go over here to settings, then go to scanner settings, and then right here when, where it says action for potentially unwanted programs, you're going to want to show in results and check for removal. With, if you don't do that, sometimes you'll get up to a couple hundred um, pups in there that you get to manually check, which it'll take forever. So a lot of people don't know. You can just, um, you know, that the setting is here. But yeah, that's how it is. And you just go ahead and run your scan. Right, thanks. Okay, now I've ran my scan here, and let's see if, what it found. So I found 22 objects. So I'm gonna click Show Results and. See now everything is um, everything is selected here, which yeah I know what this is from from this conduit some variety of different programs you download from like download.com will come bundled with a bunch of crapware so I'll go through that on there but this isn't that many and there's only 20 but I worked on some computers that have to up to like 900 so you know there's no way I was gonna go through and manually do those so you know that's why do, doing that ahead of time helps and then. I just remove them. Sometimes I'll have you reboot, sometimes it won't. Which right now it will, but um, other times when it's just minor stuff, it, it won't have you reboot.